Hi guys, Cyrus here. So today, special video. As you know, I've been using the BenQ 2546K for two months or even three months now. And today I'm gonna say my preview about this monitor and why you should try this monitor or take this monitor. Let's go. start i would like to say a huge thank you to BenQ uh to send me this monitor and to let me the chance to make this preview uh it's a huge honor for me i've been using the BenQ monitor since the beginning since i start like since, since i start playing video games actually gaming uh never been disappointed about the monitors always been at the top and this one is even more at the top so let's get started but the strong point of the 2546K is the DYAC, the dynamic accuracy. It's proprietary to BenQ Zoe technology, which is used on their higher and or their higher gaming monitors. It's designed to reduce the eye tracking motion blue. Here is a good example. Even if it was shown on CSGO, you can trust me, you can feel it in PUBG and it makes a difference. You also have a S switch. What is the S switch? It's external of the monitor. It will help you, it's like a controller that will help you to slide and change all your monitor settings super smoothly and super fast. You also have the possibility with the S switch to change the quick menu. How to do it? It's simple. You go into custom quick menu and then you could put whatever you want. It can be the DYAC mod, just even the black equalizer, color vibrance, brightness, whatever. But it means that you can easily change what everything you want in game. So what's the cool points? You have a smaller base, more playing space. It's flexible and fluid height and tilt adjustment. XL settings to share for quicker monitor config setting. So yeah, you have been a lot to ask me what are my monitor settings. But now, with the 2546K, you have an, an intern like a software that you just download. And with this, you can just easily export all your settings from the monitor to another monitor. For example, during land, it will be way easier than just going on each monitors every time you want to play and just changing your settings. Now you can easily just get on the USBK what you want and easily apply it. It was my first time of my life doing a preview like this. Again, thank you so much, thank you, and hope you enjoyed the video. Take care, everyone.